In Afghanistan, we have. In Afghanistan, we have. I don't know if you remember me or not, but I was in your office a few weeks ago. My name's Angie Kearns, and I live in Charleston. And my husband's company employs 400 people. Over half of them are on state assistance right now because of the rates that Medicaid and waiver programs pay to caregivers. They cannot afford to pay a living wage. If you pass this bill, Senator, just by investing in the health care portion of this, not only would it remove over 200 people from the system, meaning medical card, food stamps, and other things, but then also would put them in a tax-paying bracket on private health insurance and allow them to hire more caregivers to take care of our aging population, which saves the state money twofold for one investment. Senator, this is an investment. This is not giving out money. This is not spending. This is investing and this is building the state that we both love. That's why we're both here fighting for our people because we love West Virginia and we believe in our state. We need you to stand with us. Can all West Virginians wave at the